You want to know what's even worse than being cheated on? For a whole lot of people, the idea of being cheated on is their single biggest nightmare, their single greatest fear. But when you've been cheated on, you discover there's something even fucking worse. You want to know what it is? It's when the other person doesn't fucking admit it. You may even have a mountain of evidence or your gut instinct when you're in your most calm state knows they fucking cheated, but they don't admit it. Do you want to know why that's so fucking painful? I'll tell you in about two fucking seconds, but let me tell you first why they fucking won't tell you. A, they don't have the fucking decency to give you the truth, but why? Because they're taking, they're takers, they're taking their own protection from your backlash, from you being disappointed, from my protection, from me looking like a bad guy. So I'm going to deny it so that I look good and no, I didn't do it and fuck you basically. And you want to know why it's so fucking much more painful than just being cheated on alone? Because one, you're causing me to distrust my own voice, even I may have a, have a mountain of evidence. But two, you're telling me, fuck you, you don't matter. You told me yesterday or two years ago that you love me and now you won't give me the fucking truth. You're protecting yourself at my own expense and so as a result, I think I'm no good and I don't matter. So let me ask you this, whose bullshit are you believing even when their mouth is yammering but you know they're full of shit? Or who are you fucking protecting, i.e. mainly yourself? And when are you going to have the decency and the courage to give the truth so that they can heal? Have a kick-ass day.